This is your story, your life, and it's your time to shine, okay? Prayer and therapy could really help this family. I've been kicked out of better places than this. Wait, let's get it back. So for this way, we're going to need a lot. But I'm thinking for the moment we need to do like a stretch commerce, stretch navigator. But for the body, I'm thinking something like a roll or something like that. Next, this is it. We also have to have something special for the mother of the room and the parents of the room. So I don't know, I was thinking something else. You know, it's tough for us right now. So, uh, I don't know. Call me Steve right here. William, Jacob, Steve. Steve. I'm not doing today welcome to another episode of whose mic is this i gotta ask you they already seen uh, the clip but i still gotta ask you whose mic is this i can't i can't hear you oh, hold on that's probably on me there we go all day, all day, we got you, we got you, we got you. Hold on, let me make sure everything. There we go. Let me make I'm listening on the other. Okay, there we go. And you sound good, girl. All right. We 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 about to have us some fun. Like I told you before, man, I've been looking forward to this interview. I ain't talked to my sis in about, what, since the Yours Awards? I think it's. I ain't no, seen you since the. Like yeah, the yours awards. That's the last time I saw you. Yep, yep. With the big uh, the uh, the awards show you hosted, uh, and brought your peoples down. Um, we always have a great, great, great time. So I got to say this: we have through 2024 Mamba mentality. I'm claiming all the success this year and wishing and congratulating you on your. Thank you, thank you. All day, all day. So, uh, welcome, Lily May. Welcome to Soldier by Blue Platform, powered by the Village Global Network. Tell our supporters where you was born and raised, and what you've been blessed to be put on this earth to do, sweetie. Wow. So I had from the last capital of. 
of the Confederacy, Danville, Virginia. Um, and I was put on this earth to be of service to others through being a voice for the voices. Nice, 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 nice. That's what I'm talking about. <clears throat> all right, all right. So, um, I believe you've been on here before because I remember asking you some great questions about your your upbringing and your family and all that. So we can skip all the formalities and we just gonna jump right into your business. All right, how? <laughs> How's your love life? How's your love life going? <laughs> you know your brother got to be in your business. Absolutely. Well, it is going very, very well. Um, wedding planning okay. is very, very stressful. Mm. Um, it comes with a lot of accommodations that require you to... But um, <laughs> this is really good. Um, definitely amazing to have a partner that's not only my. Nice, <laughs> nice, nice, nice. All right, okay, so. You you already getting into the next question because you know I, I I really don't know but I'm I'm thinking people still like to be in relationships I'm just you know I'm I'm hoping that but with that being said what do you have advice what advice do you have for the ladies on relationships. Mm -hmm. Man, you, you, I'm, I'm, I think that's for every, like you said, that's for everybody. That's something for everybody because I know that's what I'm, um, getting in tune with now. You know, like, you go through life really on automatic sometimes. You don't even know that you're doing that until, you know, either a magnifying glass on you or, or you reflecting in your life for real. And then you got to know those type of things so that, that, professional thing is definitely something that um that i love that you said because if you don't know eh, you kind of beating you know hitting that score and just rescoring that that wound for real for real all right talk to us about the men i know that was for me give us give us another advice but this talk to us men what what we need to do talk, give us some give us some advice you know, I have some very, very And you know this, man. 
<laughs> Most definitely. That is great. That's why I mess with my sis. She she always had a good uh the you good know, advice. I'm gonna keep it real. I'm gonna keep it real and you know a lot of people don't like it. A lot of You get what I'm saying? And right. I'm talking about relationships. I'm talking about situations. That, see, situationships are easy because you can pick them up and throw them away. But consistency and true, authentic relationships require work. And a lot of people don't know how to put in work. Right, right. Man, and that work... Is meant to work too, god damn it. <laughs> it's, it's, let me tell you, it's more mental than anything. I can tell anybody with that 80 20 rule, I say it's definitely 80% mental. Mm. It is 80% mental. Period. Man, 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 man. Woo! Man, we can we can go on and on about relationships. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm definitely, I feel like I'm a relationship expert, but not like. A good one. <laughs> I could tell you about. Yeah, I, I could tell you about some relationships, but um, I'm still a, 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 a working myself. You know, figuring out. And we all are. And I think, I think that's the thing. And advice for everybody: understanding that we are all a work in progress. Progress. And so. The hardest thing to do is admit that you're flawed. Because a lot of times you're looking at other people's relationships and you're seeking what they have and trying to model what they have, not understanding that you're not the person they are and your partner isn't the person that their partner is. Mm. You can't mirror and model people's relationships. You don't really know what's going on in their relationship. Real talk, real talk. That that kills a lot of people trying to compare themselves to others. I, I peep that too. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. And competing and competing with other people. Um, just just a couple of days ago, you know, I I said to myself, sometimes I shy away from telling people what type of things I have going on. <laughs> yes. But once again, it goes back to being sure of yourself mm. and knowing who you are and knowing that you are not in competition with anybody but yourself. And if you are in competition with other people, you are already ready to go. Oh, dang. Talk, talk to him. Talk to him, man. <laughs> Woo. Man, um, Lily May, I, I gotta ask you this, man. How? So, um, I. It's a question for people who um, are straight up, you know, very confident in in their maker, confident on who they are, but at the same time, know that that we have flaws also because we're human. Um, how do you keep your your um, mental? focused on that when you have so many people around you that's not on it and kind of make you feel bad that you you are you kind of you know well number one what people feel mm. I should be because when my mother and father named me Lily May, they already knew that I was destined to be different and I was destined for greatness. 